Welcome to Insurrection Field in Brain, Washington, BS, home of the Cadavers. The Cadavers? What creative genius came up with that name? Well, when a team asks the biggest NFL star announcer what he thinks the team should be named, he gives his opinion. Well, in my opinion, the only name more stupid would be the Commanders. <laughs> Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The full metal mayhem bang heads against the Brain Washington Cadavers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Are you ready for some NFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Newtons I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Ow! Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team! What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all! Ho-ho! Va-va-va-boom! And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown on today. Looks like it's a good fit. First down and six. Picks up maybe four on that play. Second and three. down and well good luck oh the strawberry fields dirty trick as my mentor hunter used to say i don't advocate drug anyone in the mood for mutant tartar well, i want sean kick to make a kick like this with his extra leg he used it like a golf club that wasn't a leg you moron that was tripod junket straight through the uprights. Suited that boy, and I'm ready for war. I'll put the back. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Murphy Brown! 
What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. stepped up and blew up <laughs> he's got a lot of guts doesn't he and he can see the ground crew cleaning him up now hot potato gets him every time and it's first and ten. Oh, that was a big hit hey bricks i'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career ah uh, let's see about a quarter after three grim but my watch is a bit slow down and five. I'd be impressed if he splits the uprights from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not gonna take it anymore. They just went zebra hunting and it looks Play, but to blow up on a play? Yeah, that's the team. Yeah. I should learn from this. He's dead, you moron. First down and forever. play defense well, of course he he could have had an interception returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game but i don't want to nitpick second down in a mile that my friends was an all pro nfl hit First and ten. And they run it for a yard. Second down and nine. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Oh, that was a snooze fest. And it's first and ten. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, my bad. Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. 
and he just used his beast boost dirty trick. This guy's a brick shit have. And that hit jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle it. Ouch! Anyone in the mood for a steak tartare? And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. First and ten. Oh my gosh! The defensive play. Oh man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Second down in a lot. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Hot. He's not going down. And that is caught for a first down. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. An eight yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third down and eight. Hot. Hot. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, MFL isn't episode. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Oh, with a brutal hit. And that'll be second and eight to go.
for a second there. Third down and eight. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. And the defense calls a thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's gotta hurt. That'll make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. <laughs> Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Two minutes remain in the half. Great. I gotta take a dump. Again? You just wet. How is that even possible? Ah, uh, it's the nachos, man. Want some? Hot, hot one, hot two. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. Second down and two. Hot, hot one. Hot. Oh, nice hit. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And he just slipped away like a greased pit. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's Max Stutzy. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field for the... Oh, he just got crushed. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. 
And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. Third quarter about to begin here, and these guys are locked in a nearly dead heat. I was locked in a dead heat under the covers last night when Brick started farting like a 4th of July fireworks finale. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Second down and ain't gonna happen, hot, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he made a mistake there. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. First and two. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. Wow! It's like a blood mobile crashing into a slaughterhouse. First and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second down and a lot. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown!
Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of ten yards. Second down and in inches. game and pick up the first nicely done and it's first and ten defense gives up five yards on that pass play second down and five the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all well that's a strange penalty called right there i'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking and it don't make much sense no but he's making a lot of dollars second down and the offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery it appears that the last ref was calling his stockbroker during the huddle and that tipped him off it looks like he won't be buying that boat anytime soon huh second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this Third down and three. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. First and eight to go. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second and three. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh man, he really wants it. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. 
And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Second down and long. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And he held on to that one for a first down. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. for every off and then to first down from a great catch was it a catch though let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out first and four hot, hot one hot two hot, hot, hot. and he zips that one in there for a touchdown i can't count the women in this game that shrieking in terror or cheering <laughs> it's an alien bricks i'm sure he loves both equally Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a sonic... First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Broke free and has open field in front of him. No touchdown today. Looks like that defender ate his bleedies this morning. First and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Eight. The offense is pretty much on stop and he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> hey. 
It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> and it's first and ten. They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> way forward is now. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. Way dirty trick on that play didn't fool the defense for a second. Second down and ten. And he picks up four on that passing catch. Third down and six. It's the fourth quarter, and we're at the two minute warning. Two minutes to go what? Third down and six. <laughs> oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And that play went nowhere fast. No game. Second down, and they use their second time out, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. Uh. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! And big deal. It's the meat for Ray Tram with a ball and didn't fall down. comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus lock. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. Yeah, but... Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And he's running like a moose right now. And it's first and ten. I won. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And defense burns its last time out. You can't take them into the locker room, so you might as well use them now. Why would you want to take a time out into the locker room, Grim? That doesn't sound right. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple.
simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Hey. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one.